Hi everyone, welcome to my channel and there it is, there, there's evidence, yeah, yeah, Yankee Candle, I was at Yankee Candle today, I was not going to go to Yankee Candle, I've been trying to do my best to avoid Bath and Body Works and Yankee Candle to avoid buying any more candles and or accessories, but you see, Yankee Candle did something, something to tempt me. And I tried to resist and I couldn't and I wanted this and okay. Yankee Candle on July 6th, the day right after their semi-annual summer sale, they put out all their fall stuff. Yeah, we knew about the candles because we've seen their candles with Autumn in the Park and Crisp Morning Air, blah, blah, blah. We've seen them, but they put out their fall accessories and they are gorgeous all of them. I had seen some of them in a local Yankee Candle authorized dealer store already and then they put them out on their website and I said oh gosh darn it I don't need any more. I had put all my fall stuff away. I knew exactly what I had. I knew I wasn't going to buy any more and then these gosh darn Yankee Candle people go and put out these beautiful things. So what did I get? The unveiling, there it is, Yankee Candles Twilight Silhouette Tea Light Holder. <sighs> now the funny thing is, is when you see this tea light holder on their website, it looks pretty. It looks nice, but it doesn't do it justice as it you were to go to see it. When you see it in person, I saw it on the website, I thought, mm, that's interesting. And then I called the store the next day and I asked if they had it and they said they did and I bought, and this is the truth, go to see it, fell in love with it, step away, said, went back home, said I don't need it, I don't want it, I have enough. The next day I literally go in with this. This is a flameless tea light. I go in and I say to myself, well, I didn't say to myself, I say to the sales assistant, I said, let me, let me just check out this flameless tea light and see, try to image, get an image of what it would look like with something inside, candlelight. And this happens. And I said, gosh, darn it. I did say that too. Gosh, darn it. It looks good. So... I stopped and I said, I thought to myself, I'm not going to get it now. I'm going to wait till 20 over 45. But you know what happened? I missed the 20 over 45. Missed it completely. Missed the 10 off of whatever. I had my Yankee Candle rewards in my hands. I was itching to spend them. I knew I was going to, yet I was trying to resist so badly. But you know what? Sometimes good things happen. And it was 30% off and I got it today. That was it. And after all of this, now here's the best part. It's no longer on the website. It has been sold out. And I am hoping the probability is, is I'm going to tell you the truth, people. On the website, it doesn't look like anything out of this world. When you see this piece in person, that's when you could see this happen. Because it is a pretty beautiful piece. Now, this Twilight Silhouette um, tea light holder is normally 20, no, 39.99. I think it is 39.95, 39.99. That's the first thing that when I saw it, I said, it's nice. It's sort of expensive. I don't want to spend. I'm going to wait for the coupon, but I missed the coupon. 30% off. I paid today for it. Uh, 20, it was on 30% off was 27.99. I had two vouchers that I wanted to use $10 off. Total I paid was $19.95 without tax, or maybe that's with tax. Yeah, with tax, I don't know. So instead of $40, I spent it almost half price. Love the piece. Love the piece, it's gorgeous, it's beautiful, it's everything that I could imagine. Do I have a place for it? I don't know, but I'm gonna figure out something. Since I have tea lights in it, I do not have to worry about or flameless ones. I put the flameless ones in there because I wanted to put it in a room that I did not want to worry about. I figured if I put it on a bookshelf, if I put it in a room that's not attended to, that I don't have to worry about fire. 
and I already saw what it looked like with these little flameless ones and I'm going to show you what it looks like. There it is. The room is dark, pretty dark. And I wanted you to see because it is quite lovely. And there it is. In a way, I know it represents fall and you could use this starting September all the way into January, all the way into March, or because it's nothing but trees without leaves. And you know, winter time, the trees don't have any leaves. So that's what it looks like. So is it beautiful? It looks gorgeous. And again, I'm gonna probably put the flameless tea lights in it because I don't want to worry about where I place this and or fire and or anything. And it looks good. So that's what's gonna happen with peace. Now, what it looks like on the other side. On this side, you're going to see a beautiful bronze metal color, trees, no leaves, and it, if you can hardly see, it has like a glittery background to it. Let me bring it up close. Just like, it looks glittery and shiny. So it gives it like a frosted finish, almost like snow, but it's just glittery and the lights go through it beautifully. On the side piece, and I will zoom in for you, on the side of this is a little knob which you pull out and the lights, the tea lights come out, different heights. And that's how you place your tea lights in without burning yourself. So at least you know that. Put it back in and the other side is cut out silhouettes of the uh, trees again. I don't know if you can use it either way. I think it might not be bad. I mean, it looks modern. It's just that you can see, you could see all the other side, maybe. No, I don't think it, it bothers. I don't know if you can use it reversible, but it's nice. But there it is, Twilight Silhouette. So I got it. I caved. I purchased it. And you know, in a way, it's a good thing that I did because it is no longer available on the website. As I mentioned, it's gone. I got the last one at my store. So I got lucky. And there you go. Now, did I buy any candles? Okay. I was going to avoid them as best as I could, but it was $5 for the small tumbler, uh, Autumn in the Park. After you spent 20 bucks, you got this for $5, so I bought Autumn in the Park because I like the tart, I like the smell, it's apple, it's pumpkin, it's leaves, it's wonderful, it's fall. So that's what I got. Now, this is about something else because I wanted to talk about something in particular. Now, Yankee Candle finished with their SAS sale. But they started doing something and they think we don't pay attention or we do. Yankee Candle started putting out their uh, sales on certain candles that they sell in Marshalls, in Home Goods, in TJ Maxx. They're called the writing jars and I've mentioned them before. Here is a writing jar. And writing jar is very pretty, 22 ounces, usually Usually they're $12.99 in, um, in Marshalls and or Home Goods. And here it is. This is a writing jar. And 22 ounces, single wick, similar to this. Almost exact, the same thing. Let's face it, it's made by Yankee Candle. I saw these on their website. And they do this occasionally. And they're $15.99, I believe, for these. Go into my local Yankee Candle store, and I mentioned to them, oh, I noticed you put out the, uh, the website put out the writing jars. And she says to me, uh, yeah, they did, but you know, you know, if you don't like it, we, we won't take it back. And I was taken, I said, what? What do you mean? I, I purchased it. Yeah, but, yeah, but those are like outlet stuff. And I go, listen, when somebody says to me, I buy it from your website and you're not going to take it back. I know something's going to happen. I'm not going to get mad or anything. I'm just going to ask why, you know, what's going on. Now, she said, no, we won't switch it out. We won't take it back. It's, it was so weird the way she spoke to me because 
it was almost as though it would be banned from the store or, or, or would wear a scarlet letter of no Yankee for you. I don't know what the heck was going on, but she said it as though, almost as though it was a final purchase for these that you see on their website. So, of course, because I don't like being told anything unless there's a reason for it, because I'm hard-headed maybe. Anyway, I, um, I, I, I checked with Yankee. Now here's the FYI on these candles, which are $15.99 on their website, either $15.99 or $15. You're going to see them. This is Cranberry Harvest. I know it's there. What's the 411? The 411 is that Yankee Candle is putting out most definitely these jars that they sell in, in the home goods and then so on and all this. I asked them, can I take it back? And they said to me, yes, you can take it back with your receipt. Be sure to bring your receipt. So if you buy this on their website, you can go back to the store with your receipt and get your money back if there's something wrong with it or you don't like the scent. I hope the price is really good. $15 or $15.99 is really an awesome price for a $27.99 candle. Now, what people are going to ask is, what about, what's the difference? And I wanted to ask the same question of them. I said to them, what's the big difference between, it's $15, what's the big difference between Yankee Candle stuff that you sell in Home Goods and Yankee Candle stuff that you sell in your store? Because my Yankee Candle sales assistant told me that the stuff from the Home Goods and the Marshalls has like not enough oils and it's not good enough and this and that but the YC customer service person clarified things for me here you go here's what they told me 22 ounce single wick jars are they the same yes are they made by Yankee yes what's the big difference the difference is according to them this 22 ounce writing jar cranberry harvest which actually smells really good um the oils are similar in both the scents are similar in both they use the same oils in the candles but they use high quality wax paraffin in the writing jar and premium wax paraffin in their yankee candle jar now this is what what she said to me so there is what's going on. So in case you buy anything from the Yankee Candle website and you happen to see things like this that are writing jars and they're $15 right now, that's the difference between the two. That plus if you want to get your money back, and I hope not, I hope you make out well, but if you want to, you can bring your receipt into Yankee store and you get your money back that way or at least get credit towards something else. and. That's what they, they will not switch out the jar. This is very important, they will not switch. So if I go to Yankee and I buy this, I can switch it out for another Yankee candle jar because it's from their store. But if I buy this, I can't switch it out. That's an FYI to all because I was told that very explicitly. So there you go. Or better yet, instead of spending $15, if you can go to your Marshall store or your home goods store. Don't forget that they're $12.99. And I'll have you know all their Yankee Candle, even Marshalls and Home Goods already has their fall scents out. So you probably might see uh, Cranberry Harvest soon and, um, and it should be good. And this is last year's one and it's so funny because I'm looking at it and it's filled with oils and it's dark and and it actually smells really good when you burn. Anyway, there you go. There's my FYI for today about Yankee Candle. And there's things and my little tiny haul. Oh, my gorgeous Twilight Silhouette um, piece, which is magnificent. And isn't that gorgeous, people? <laughs> Thank you for watching. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. And take care. Bye-bye.